Hello, I'm Bud Alberry. I'm the business manager and financial secretary of Local 46 in Seattle, Washington. We are meeting with a few of our members, uh, talking about the brother and sisterhood here in Local 46 and seeing how some people came in and how they started their life with us in the IBW. I've got Brian here sitting with me and Brian, why don't you give us a little feedback about how you came here and how you got into the union, just so we can hear your background first. I was working non-union in Oklahoma, Missouri, Kansas, and a little bit in Arkansas. I was in a situation where I was staring down the barrel of not having a retirement, not having the ability or the financial security to ever quit what I was doing. I felt stuck behind the eight ball and I wasn't in the in crowd with the company I worked for. And um, I realized that if I was gonna have a retirement, have some financial security, I was gonna have to make a change. So I sold everything I own, moved 2,000 miles across the country to Seattle, Washington, where my wife had family. And the first thing I did was go down to the Union Hall and join. All right. And it was the best decision I ever made in my life. Since you've joined and been here a while now, how's your wife like the pension and the health and welfare and the payroll? My wife loves every bit of the benefits that I have. Um, you know, it's a fully, uh, the benefit, the, my health benefits fully paid for by the by the employer. I had to work until Tuesday morning at 10 a.m. in Oklahoma to pay the premium to have my wife included on my insurance in Oklahoma. Mm -hmm. And um, so she loves that aspect of it. The coverage is great. Um, my wife uh, now is a uh, domestic engineer. She does not work anymore. She has her master's degree and gets to stay home because I make enough money to support us in a manner that we were not unaccustomed to in the state of Oklahoma. All right, when, when you're not at work, and I know you've made a lot of friends here, and how, how do you go about helping the union out when you're, when you're off hours? I'm an officer of the local. I'm on the exam board. Uh, I volunteer on multiple committees. Uh, I organize, with the organizing uh, department, I go out and door knock on blitzes. I uh, am the chairman of the welcoming committee. I speak to each and every new member orientation class that we have come in and tell them about the benefits of being active in their, in their union. Um, you get out of what you put into in being a union member. So your standard of living has changed a lot since you moved here to Seattle then? My standard of living has changed dramatically since I moved here. Um, you know, I was lucky in Oklahoma to have $1,500 in my savings account, you know, and now I, I've got a full year's house payments in a savings account just for the hard times when they come. I have more than $20,000 in my 401k. My work life is very different. Um, I am now evaluated on my strengths and what I bring to the job instead of uh, how I'm related to the owner of the company. Uh, my life has changed dramatically in the fact that I don't have to maintain a truck full of tools. We just have a much more secure, stable lifestyle here after being in, in the union. Another thing I really enjoyed about it is the ability to have challenges on the job. You know, I'm no longer just roping MC through walls. You know, I get to build big gear and run big pipe and the things that I really enjoy about the job. Well, that's, that's really interesting, Brian, and it's been really good talking with you and hearing where you're from and how good have you been doing. And I hope that uh, we'll see more, more of you and get to know you a lot better at the union meetings and some of the other functions. And thank you very much.